How do food reviews here of Chuck E. Cheese pepperoni pizza? It says, good source of calcium made with 100% real mozzarella cheese. It's all the nutrition facts right there. Pause the screen if you want. I can't believe I finally found this at Walmart. Now, they're supposed to be having almost like Tostino's type of pizza rolls as well, but they also have the classic pizza, and they also have pizza rolls. But I found the pizza, I found the cheese, and the pepperoni, but I bought the pepperoni instead because I'm a fan of the pepperoni. But anyway, Chuck E. Cheese. Let me tell you the story, quick story of Chuck E. Cheese here, and the reason why I'm so excited to try this. So when I was about probably eight years old for my birthday I really wanted to go to Chuck E. Cheese and my parents tried to find the closest Chuck E. Cheese was the closest Chuck E. Cheese was in Syracuse I believe and I believe it's uh, closed now I don't think there's a Chuck E. Cheese there but I think there used to be yeah there used to be a Sy there used to be a Chuck E. Cheese in Syracuse or Albany I believe and it's well closed now I don't think there's any more Chuck E. Cheese really left well there is still Chuck E. Cheese but they're very few but anyway, I've always wanted to try anything from Chuck E. Cheese. And I definitely will be cutting out this box here to keep in my collection. Like, just to cut out the front to put in my collection for a keepsake. But Chuck E. Cheese pepperoni pizza here. So let's put this in the oven. Alright, so it's all done. Doesn't look like the best pizza in the world, but let's try it. I've heard that Chuck E. Cheese's pizza is... Like, you go to the actual Chuck E. Cheese, it's not that good, I've heard. But, let's see it for myself. Let's see if this is any good. Kind of tastes like they put a piece of cardboard and they put the pizza toppings on it. Yeah, this isn't the best pizza in the world, but it's it's fun. It's fun that I've actually got to try ch something from Chuck E. Cheese. Hopefully, I could try the pizza rolls pretty soon if I can find them at Walmart. But yeah, this isn't the greatest pizza in the world. I mean, it's pizza. It's it's pretty good. It's edible, but it's not the greatest pizza in the world. I'd rather have a Red Baron. Or a uh, DiGiorno pizza. Or even Tony's. Uh, over this to be honest. But this is alright. I, I honestly would give this a 4 out of 10. It's pretty cool. 